I did it all for the cookie! I ate a cookie, so shove it up your ass! I'm sure that's what they're gonna say in the future. Everybody will worship Limp Biscuit in the future. Um, I realized last time... I don't know, if I was watching this and I saw someone run by a robot dog, I'd be like, Why didn't you find out about that, asshole? I'd be like, Go fuck yourself! And they'd be like, You're me. <laughs> like, Sorry, Grandma. Somebody's gotta do it. Alright, let's go ask about the dog. Hey. Talk to me, King. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So, what can I do for you? I would like to ask about your dog. Where'd you get the robot dog? I got Rex here from a salvager a few years ago. He was a little dinged up when I got him. But one of the followers fixed him right up. Followers of my dick? He doesn't seem very happy. He goes through spells like this from time to time. The followers said his brain is going bad or something. Mine too, uh, yeah. Can I help? I don't know. Maybe. If you found a way to help my poor Rex here, I'd be much obliged. All right. Your best bet will be to talk to Julie Farkas over at the old Mormon fort north of here. Maybe you'll have better luck than I did. Uh, all right. I'm off to talk to Fart Gas. All right. I'll see you later. Not nothing but a hound dog. Suck my dick all the time. Excuse me, sir. That was very rude of you to try and suck my delicious dick. <laughs> Let's go find Julie Fart Gas. And see if we can ask her about uh, the amazing Rex. I should probably rename him. Rex is kind of a lame name. Can I call him Theodorus Rex? That sounds much cooler. Hey. Um, all right, where do I go? Oh, I gotta go to the Mormon Tabernacle Choir. I should know where the old Mormon fort is by now. I've only been there like 50 different times. <laughs> Yay! Play for the. Oh, I was looking at baseball there. Petro Chico. That guy's gonna get NAD cancer riding the atomic uh, thing there like a cowboy. He's like, Mom, maybe those are his balls. Maybe that's what happened when they got irradiated. He's like, they're huge! Hey, little kid, don't listen to my ball talk. That's probably not a. Pro Who's that standing out there? Let me get my weapons. Hello, friend! You hear about that band of crazy old ladies running around? I hear they're real vicious when they mug folks. <laughs> old ladies? Yeah, I'm really scared about Grandma Gang. What are they gonna do? Hit me with their walkers? <laughs> what a wuss. No wonder why the NCR was shoving these dweebs around. I have old people! I'm so scared! Uh, at least I guess he's not, she's not racist. Alright, so Julie Fargas, she's the cute chick with the mohawk. Did I help you, dweebs? Why are you standing on your friend? That seems really rude, Wayne. Hope what I remembered helps. Hey, I helped you guys. Tell the king we thank him for looking out for us. You're welcome. Oops, I almost shot him. God, we had that happen before. <laughs> hey, Julie! Julie! Julie Fartgas! Is there something you need? Doggy, um, the king says something you could tell me about his robo-dog. Rex? It breaks my heart every time I see him. He's such a good dog. He's such a good dog. <laughs> Uh, you can't heal him? No. Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. He requires brain surgery and some sophisticated cybernetics work, too. So he's never gonna get better? I didn't say that. While no one here has that kind of expertise, I do know of one man who might fit the bill. There's an old scientist named Dr. Henry who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. He'd probably be your best bet. Last I heard, he was living up in Jacobstown, far to the northwest. That's not very helpful. No problem. Um... Yeah, see you. Yeah, don't even say goodbye. Thanks for that useless information. I was gonna help that doggy. Whoa. That was weird. Hello. <laughs> Hi. You little weird dude. Alright, let's see what else we can do mission-wise, because we're not gonna go to Jacobstown. Because to do that... I don't even know where the hell it is. It's in the mountains somewhere. We could go beat up that drug dealer. That seems like a good time. I don't even remember why. They wanted me to help with Bill because he'd fix the water. I just want to beat up the drug dealer. That just seems like the right thing to do. Not because he's chilling drugs, but just because I haven't beat anyone in a while. Alright, high times? Oh yeah. Hey, baby. Surprise! Howdy. All right. 
Your face is dirty. I should buy you um, some washcloths. What the hell is that? It's part of a thug. <laughs> it was the <laughs> He's just hanging around, <laughs> looking right at me. Your head is tidy, dude. I should put it in my pocket. Pull it out as a puppet. Hey, want to see my puppet? I can make it talk, and people will be like, oh, bleh. I don't remember killing someone there. I've probably killed a fair amount of people, though. I get a little violent. Well, it's Charlie Dicksucker's fault. He's just trying to survive in a world where he got shot in the face. Okay, so... I don't know where to go. Wanna get lucky? Head on down to the Atomic Wrangler. Alright, I will go to the Atomic Wrangler to get lucky. I just don't... I can't talk to, like, the person who owns it. Because there was a mission where she's like, collect all this money for me. And I collected it, but I didn't bring it back to pay her. I figured it was better in my pocket than her. This game's mostly about loading today. Yep. Who the fuck are you? Yep, I'm still just as a member. Oh, can I play slots? Oh, I don't want to go buy no chips. Hey, fuckheads. Um... Wait, who am I looking for? I thought one of them was here in the casino. Any of you dweebs? No, no. Is it you, sexy pants? No. Nobody wants to play roulette. Aha, uh -huh, nobody likes you. Hello? I am so lost. What's always happened to me? Alright, so I looked through the um, Atomic Wrangler and I found nothing. You the guy I gotta talk to? <laughs> oh, no. Don't hack at me, Colonel Sanders. Are you the drug dealer? Looking for a fix, man? I got what you need. Uh, do you know anything about Bill or Jacob? Or can you give me the cheap booze that gets you fucked? Yeah, man. Those cats are out of their domes, addicted to my shit. They can't get enough. <clears throat> Pretty hilarious to watch. They're addicted to your poop? That's nasty. Um, why are you trying to kill them? Those fools are from NCR. I love seeing those squatters in agony. We were doing just fine before those shits came here and made a mess of things. We don't need NCR eggheads wandering around confusing things. I kind of agree with you, dude. I hate the NCR, too. But you probably should stop, like, supplying those dudes. Really? Ah, oh, you're such a saint. I know. You know what? I might be willing to stop if there's something in it for me. Uh... Oh, I'm so close on the speech thing. If you don't leave them alone, I'll, I'll tell on you. Wow, you really suck at this, don't you? Go bully some mole rats. Nobody jackass. is fucking rude to Charlie Dixon. caps, and I'll stop selling to them. Otherwise, it is just too much fun watching them spiral no. downward. No, fuck you. It'd be a lot cheaper and easier for me to kill your dumb ass. Ooh, I you always fucking enjoy rude. good scrap. I do not put up with motherfucking rude people. This is what happened to rude people. Use some manners! That will teach you manners. Excellent. I don't know if that solved the mission. <laughs> Nothing to see here, good citizens. I, the NCR Polite Police, have solved the problem. I wonder if our kid friend is still up here. He's the one who sold me the cool laser gun. Did I almost step on a ghoul or something? What the fuck was that? Maybe my guy farted on the way up. It's like, oh man, I was holding that in forever. Hey, don't fight. Dude, Max. I wish I had a gun. I'm bored. You want a gun, I Max? I wish I had a gun. I'll give you one. Give me my thousand caps back. Give you a pistol. Don't hit the girl, though. She seems okay. Let's go into Mick and Ralph's. Maybe they can get us the ID the king the king promised us. Well, I probably ought to go talk to Bill or whoever. Now that I helped him with his drug addiction by murdering his druggie. <laughs> That's the worst rehab ever, I guess. Excuse me, good sir. The king sent me. Playing debt collector for the Garrets, huh? I guess someone has to do their dirty work. Oh, I was? Oh, I didn't remember doing that. The king said you could give me a pass to the strip. One of his boys stopped in and said you had won the king's favor. You've done right by this town and deserve a pass. Here you go. Woo! Thanks, Ralph. See ya. 
got my counterfeit pass! Suck my ass! What are you doing? Welcome back. Hi. Um, yeah, do you have any special items for sale? Why? Do you work for one of the casinos? No. In that case, yes I do. Yes. Follow me. Holy tits! That's cool. Like I always say, a polite society is an armed society. Um, what do you got? Bladed gauntlet? That's kind of cool. I'm not really into that. A grenade machine gun? <laughs> Holy fuck! I want that! Oh, man. I wish I had some money. That would be so fucking cool. A machine gun that shoots grenades. I don't think we really need any of this other stuff. Sawed off shotgun. I want to mine a silence 22. Actually... Which is it? That's not bad. Can you give me a silence 22? That might be useful when I'm working alone places. I'm going to equip that, and then I'm going to head up to the... Str no, I'm going to go find Bill a second so we can be like, You're not addicted to drugs anymore! I murdered your dealer! He was rude to me. I just had to. You never know in this old west town who might shoot you for being rude. It'll probably be me. <laughs> Um, I don't think this is Bill. I think this might be Jacob. You have chems, buddy? I could really use a fix. They're my butthole. Would you like to suck them out? Uh, you look pretty bad, Jacob. You should probably stop using chems. Why stop? I feel great. No worries. My guy will be here soon enough. Just wait. Uh, who's supplying you? If it's Dixon, he's not showing up. If I had two caps to scrape together, I'd buy the materials to make my own. My damn hands won't stop shaking. This guy named Dixon. Something about him seems sketchy, but I can't stop now. Last time I stopped, I felt like I was gonna turn inside out. At this point, I'm mostly buying his stuff just so I don't feel sick. Speaking of which, do you have any spare caps? Uh, dude, I killed your dealer. You're gonna have to clean up. What? I need a fix now! I want you to get well, Jacob. I care about you, guy I don't know. Fine. If you really care so much, then give me some shots of Fixer to calm down these shakes. I'm gonna need at least ten shots to get me through the week. From there, the followers should be able to help. Um, a combination of... I wish this would work speech. A combination of Fixer, Cycle, and Buff Out would do it in one shot. Mm, I'm a science nerd! Never thought about using that combination before. Should be able to get through this with that. Dude, Charlie Dick Sucker knows a shitload about drugs. <laughs> He's like, I know what you can do. I've got the detox chemicals you need, buttface. Thank God. I thought I was gonna die if you didn't come back soon. I was here the whole time. I'm gonna head to the followers' fort to get some rest and detox. You've saved my life, friend. Whatever. Lucky I don't shoot you. You were not rude, so you survive. For now. Oh, I got some fame and freeside. I'm famous. Maybe somebody else I'm guessing I killed. Let's take his clothes. <laughs> Do you want to die? Oh, it's okay, Vagrant. I feel... I was the rude one. Oh, no, I'm going to have to kill myself. I was rude to the Vagrant. Why didn't I know better? I know the rules. Oh, let's go find uh, Bill. Hey, guy I used to work with whose name I don't remember. Uh, that's awkward. Yo, Bill. Come on, man. I'm dying here. Sissy. Oh, I wish I could use that one. <laughs> you made a sissy. You're not going to see Dixon anymore, dude. He was rude. What the hell? Why? I need alcohol, man. I'm going to die if I don't get a drink. I want a drink. You need to kick the habit, Bill. I can help you by kicking you in your balls. The only way you can help me now is a load of detox chems. What do you need? At least a couple of doses of Fixer, a, a bottle of whiskey, and Radaway. Right I can take doses of Fixer and Radaway right to gradually flush my system over time while drinking decreasing shots of diluted whiskey. This shit better be worth it, man. Um, science! Regulating decreasing doses of booze with a couple shots of Fixer should do it. You don't even need the other thing, dummy. Man, you're one hell of an egghead. If you think it'll work, I'll give it a shot. 
I'm the ner I'm the Bill Nye of the fucking wasteland. Bill, I got what you asked for. I felt like I was dying these past weeks off and on, but the worst is yet to come. In a few days, though, I should be free. I'll head over to the followers and see if they'll help me through this. You took my whiskey? I want my... I don't... I don't... No. I do not approve of this, Bill. <clears throat> How am I going to have my alcoholism work when you're stealing your stuff, my stuff for rehab? Damn you. <laughs> Yeah, well, let's go talk to Julie Fartgas, that's old Mormon thing. I don't remember why I was helping her. Charlie Dick Sucker has memory issues. <laughs> Maybe he drinks too much. He blacks out, and I'm like, I just, uh, think I need to help somebody. I don't even remember the Mormon places. It must be down here. You would think by now I would know Freeside very well. I should. Oh, I like the colors there. But I don't. I get lost so easily. It's just like when I go to the mall. I'm good in the woods. In the woods, I can find my way around in real life. You go to the mall, I'm like, I'm lost! And they'll be like, we parked by JCPenney's. I don't know where that is! I think I'm in the Sahara! I'm gonna die here. Alright, I think I need to talk to Julie. There's weird Beatrice. Hey! Uh, don't touch me. Don't, don't egg at me. Uh, Julie! Julie, are you in here? Are you and you guys, Julie? Where'd your friend go that you were standing on, Wayne? You, Julie? Where's Julie? Nice goggles when there. When people have got nothing left, whoa, they can whoa, always turn to the whoa, followers. What? 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 What's in your way? <laughs> Wait, it should be like right there. Is she hiding in the background? Yep. Oh, I didn't, you can go in. Well, actually, I forgot you could go in there, to be honest. Julie? Hey, Julie! Hi, do you need assistance? I helped you. Uh, I helped that addiction problem you mentioned. I saw them. Thank you so much for helping them. This means a lot to the followers of the Apocalypse. You have our thanks. If you need some medical supplies, come see me. With Jacob working with us, we should be able to spare a stim or fixer once a day. Um... Medical supplies you said I could have? Oh, and I got some fame with the followers of the apocalypse and fame free side. Sure. Would you like a stim pack, fixer, or rat away? Stim pack, because I get my ass shut up all You'll the time. You'll need to wait another 24 hours for us to get more made. We need everything else we currently have. You need to wait 24 hours before I punch you in the ovaries for that kind of attitude. Uh, you need medical supplies? Rates of injury and illness in free side are very high. Supplies don't last long. What do you need? Medex, Radaway, and Fixer are free side essentials. I can't pay you for any supplies you bring in, but I could discount the charge for our services. Mm. Seems like you need a steady supply, not whatever I can grab you, lady. Can I grab you? So far, the Crimson Caravan won't cut us a deal. If you can convince them or some other merchant to work with us, I'll discount supplies to you. Um, which merchants might be willing to make this deal, lady? You might ask around at Mick and Ralph's, or go see the Garretts, though I suspect they're too busy poisoning Freeside to help it out. Alright, I'll do that. Just come see me when you've got some supplies to turn in. What do you want to talk about? Um... Bye. Why don't you ever say goodbye? She's so rude. Accepted. Folks have come to accept you for your helpful nature. I'm glad they like us there. So let's move our speech up because our speech is woefully low that was weird <laughs> did she know the level up thing she's like what was that why is there a noise in the screen nothing happened don't judge me <laughs> that should just you know wait what did she want me to do she wanted me to go back to Mick and Ralph's but I wanted to go get Benny I guess it wouldn't hurt me to do one little side um, trip to Mick and Ralph's what the fuck am I doing I'm spinning around confused Looking through my quests here, I don't actually see it in the quests. Nope. Oh well. We're gonna run over to Mick and Ralph's anyway a second and see what happens.
All right, back to Mick and Ralph's. Oh man, we just like run over the pla all over the place. You think these guys could take a you know, th what was it? That was a two or three block walk themselves. Whatever, they're all a bunch of lazy ass. Hey, uh, dude. Hey, thanks for getting Bill Ronte fixed up. I was really getting sick of paying for water. No problem. Now, what can I do for you? Um, the followers are looking up to get a supply deal for medicines. We don't have the stills and equipment to supply the amount of meds they're looking to purchase. Really? You could check with other wasteland merchants, but I think your best bet would be the Atomic Wrangler. They've got a bunch of stills and a seemingly endless supply of grain alcohol, which could be used as anesthetic or disinfectant. Or booze. That sounds like a good idea. Come back anytime. Suck my dick anytime. Not really! <laughs> I think I'm going to end it here. I hate to break mid-mission. Next mission, we'll probably go to the Atomic Wrangler. Hopefully they're not mad that I haven't returned with their money. Let's see if we can set up a still to help out Julie. I know I got a little sidetracked on all this, but... Who the fuck is this guy? Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around here, right? The king says to keep up the good work. and said to give you this. Don't hit me! Oh, bottle caps? Thanks. That's what happens when they really love you. They bring you stuff. I guess if you're hated, they probably attack you. You see that vagrant? That's the way to do it. That's how you get bottle caps. You murder rude people. Take it easy, everybody.